with the invention of camera-based smart sensor technology. TKH Security revolutionized what a parking guidance system can do. Yet this powerful and complex system is streamlined and easy to install. The heart of the TKH security system is the M5 smart sensor, which uses cameras to monitor space occupancy, enhance security, and to read license plates for vehicle identification. The sensors are attached to an overhead aluminum mounting system via removable clips. Channel sections are joined using a variety of connecting pieces. Digital wayfinding signs guide drivers to vacant parking spaces throughout the garage. Power cabinets provide power and data access to the network. TKH Security provides most of the hardware. Cables for power and data are provided pre-cut and pre-terminated. Only a few cable runs need to be produced on site. The main parts the contractor needs to supply are nuts, washers, ceiling anchors, and hanging rods. What's more, throughout the entire installation process, TKH Security provides you with exceptional documentation and support, including detailed manuals and full-site drawings. Throughout the process, an assigned TKH Security Project Manager will work with you to ensure the project is a success. Let's get started. Step 1 of the installation is hanging the aluminum channel. Your site drawings will indicate the path for the channel to take. Common anchoring parts are inserted into the ceiling. Hanging clips are secured with simple nuts and washers. Each section hung typically requires two to three hanging clips. Now you're ready for the aluminum channel, which you'll cut to length on site. The channel slides into the connecting pieces. A quick twist of the hanging clip locks it in place. The M5 sensor clips to the channel using the removable clips. Before installing, refer to the drawings for exact sensor location. Install the sensor, making sure the cables are tucked carefully under the mounting brackets, and make sure the camera lens is pointing in the correct direction for the parking spaces being monitored. Once you've installed a string of M5 sensors, it's time to run the PoE cable in a daisy chain configuration. The provided pre-terminated cables are designed to snap right in and a weatherproof cap to protect the connection. Follow the daisy chain layouts on the drawings. The cables will be neatly concealed within the aluminum channel. Finally, install a weatherproof end cap on the last sensor to protect the connection. Some installations require a PoE injector and it's marked on the drawings. Where required, install the injector on the channel, connecting to the first sensor in the string, with the power and data terminated to one side and a PoE cable to the other. Digital signage is a key part of the wayfinding process for a TKH security system. As with installation of the smart sensors, a daisy chain configuration is used. The site drawings will have detailed instructions for correct placement of all signs for which you will need to pull and terminate cables for power and data. Note, in addition to signs produced by TKH Security, an installation may include the integration of custom signs produced by other companies. Power cabinets, which house the power supplies and network gear for each level of the garage, tie the system together. The daisy chain wiring process begins with pulling power and data cables from the power cabinet to a few of the sensors and signs. Power wiring for both sensors and signs connects to the appropriate power cabinets. POE and data cables are terminated, then plugged into the cabinet switch. Once the final AC power and data trunk connections are made, the power cabinet is ready to support its entire designated network of devices. When power is first applied to the system, built-in features help confirm proper installation of the M5. The LED lights on the smart sensors will blink either blue or purple, depending on the state of the network. Signs will briefly display a few numbers for testing, then go blank. TKH security solutions frequently include the C5 smart counting solution, the S2 smart sensing solution, and LCD signage. Installation is simple for the C5 and S2 since they use standard CCTV hardware. 
Additionally, LCD signage installation is similar to our other digital wayfinding signage installation. At this point, the on-site installation is complete and the TKH Security Commissioning Team can finish the process. Here's a quick recap of the M5 system installation steps. Channel, M5 sensors, signs, power cabinets, power on. For a more detailed look at the TKH security installation process, refer to our M5 system installation guide. More and more TKH security parking guidance systems are being installed in your region and across the globe. As an approved parking guidance system installer, you'll have the opportunity to use these new skills many times over. Thanks for watching this installation overview video. We look forward to working with you.